Hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel. It's definitely been a little while since my last video. Um, I have been going through a lot personally. Um, my uncle actually had gotten very sick. Um, thank God he is better now, but that was like a whirlwind of uh, emotion. Um, but personally for me, um, I have been battling with depression. Um, God, I didn't think it was going to be this hard. So, this is actually the second time I've been in my makeup room since my last video. Um, I don't have any tissues. Hold on. The first one was to actually clean it. <laughs> uh, this is the first time I've actually touched any kind of makeup. God, I, I feel like such an amateur. I can't even get my bras right and it's just pissing me off. Um, but I don't know. I just, I wanted to film and I wanted to be here because this is like my happy place other than my kids. like this is for me and this is what I enjoy and when you're so far down the rabbit hole and you can't even muster up the energy to do what you love there's a problem um so <laughs> I'm sorry that this video is starting off like with kind of I just wanted to kind of be real with you guys about everything um depression is not something that you can just be like girl get over it it'll be fine or you know it's it's no big deal you're just a little sad like it goes so far beyond that it's I have days where I don't even want to get out of bed <laughs> and the only reason I do get out of bed is because I mean I have to work I have to pay the bills <laughs> I don't pay the bills and we're not gonna have a house um, you know my kids have to go to school and they have their stuff so I'm strong for them but when it comes to self-care and doing for me God I I haven't done anything but I am starting therapy um, if you guys or any one of you guys are battling depression please 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 see somebody um, it is a hard thing to fight you cannot fight it on your own you can't fight it on your own no matter how strong you think you are uh, so I uh, tell you what <laughs> I'm going to regroup and then we're gonna go ahead and get to some unboxings I've had like two boxy charms and two ipsies I've been sitting aside I've had them for a while but I like I said I just I couldn't get in here um, but I definitely want to do this video because I need to get me back on track to what I love and what I love is filming and making my videos and talking to you guys and connecting um, with the same love that we all have in common and that is makeup and skincare and just you know uplifting one another and <laughs> that is a positive happy place for me so I am desperately trying to come back I am 
obviously not probably going to be doing it like full force. Here's my schedule. Um, I need to take this day by day and just see where I can take myself, if that makes any sense. So, uh, okay. Uh, first time I've worn mascara. <laughs> Uh, but my brows are really irritating me. You know, I have used to have really nice full brows and um, my brow lady has kind of zipped them into nothing. So I think over the next couple months, I am just going to let these suckers grow wild. <laughs> uh, well, that ruined that part of that mascara, didn't it? Yep. Okay, so... I'm a hot mess. I'm sorry. Okay, so like I said, I have two Ipsies and two Boxy Charms. I'm really not going to go through each item because I don't want to keep you guys forever and um, it is kind of getting a little bit late. <laughs> I do need to go to bed because I have to work in the morning. So uh, we're just going to start with Boxy Charm real fast. So this is the base box and in here. This is actually kind of skin care heavy on this month, which you guys know. I I mean, I enjoy skin care, just um, not my whole box. <laughs> so I was able to get, this is the uh, Clean Skin Club Clean Slate Clearing Mist. The uh, Kate Somerville Exfoliate, Exfoli Kate? Exfoliate Glow Moisturizer. Uh, let's see, we got two masks which is something that uh, Ipsy is known to do um, obviously Ipsy took over BoxyCharm but Ipsy will give you two two masks as one product so that is what they did here uh, we got what is this the Ciate London shadow flip shifting liquid shadow I think I do have another one of these so I have to check the shade if it's the same shade then I'll probably put it in a giveaway um, but they're actually really, really pretty. And then we got the Iconic Bronzer in the shade Light Bronze. <sighs> so, very, very pretty packaging. It's huge. Absolutely huge. That's a pretty bronzer. That's actually right up my alley. So, um, I actually do like that. The skincare, I mean, I like Kate Somerville, but I do have a lot of skincare, so that's probably all going to go in a giveaway. My nose gets all itchy when I um, when I cry. So, uh, the first item was the vibrate, vib vibrating face facial massager. God. <sighs> okay, so this is what it looks like. My daughter says she wants it. I'll probably end up giving it to her. Um, the Zoeva lipstick oh, okay this is a lipstick I think I missed this and lip twist in the shade Helen um, oops it's like a lip crayon it's a pretty color though It'd be really nice for fall yeah Okay, and it's really soft. I like that. Uh, let's see, what else did we have? We had a highlighting powder from, from Ves Vesca or whatever. Um, a styling leave-in. This is from Bumble and Bumble. Bumble and Bumble. Gel cream conditioning detangles and fights frizz for soft sea swept waves. I'll probably give this to my daughter too. She's been complaining lately of the um, frizziness in her hair because we live in a very humid place. Uh, from Wishful, this is a honey balm jelly moisturizer. Probably put that in the giveaway. And these I actually will keep for myself. These are the LaRousse face pads. So I guess they're like clean cleansing pads, but they're really, really soft. I like that. 
yeah, wipe away your day with this alternative, eco-friendly solution to disposable makeup wipes and cotton pads. It contributes towards a safe and sustainable planet due to its reusability and washability. The organic bamboo cotton has soft plush fibers that will gently remove impurities. It is versatile, means it can be used in different types of application. So um, if you guys want to see this highlighter, by the way, I know I didn't show you what it looks like and I just ripped the box. So if I give it and I give away, I'm sorry if I ripped the box, but the product is not harmed, okay? So this is the packaging. Um, the shade is called Moonlight. This is supposed to be vegan and cruelty free. Mm. Just your kind of like average highlighter. I mean, it looks pretty. I just, I'm pretty sure I have highlights like this, so I will more than likely put this in a giveaway. All right, so that's it for BoxyCharm. Um, best ever? No, not the best ever. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. That Maybe that premium box wasn't like so, so bad, but... 20, 30, like, uh, I just, I do like more products, makeup products than skincare, and in both boxes this month, uh, they gave me skincare. So, moving on to Ipsy. One thing I do like about Ipsy uh, is that once I get my bag, I can actually go online and rate it each product and what I liked about the product, what I didn't like about the product. Um, that's really nice. I think BoxyCharm, you can rate your box, but I think it's not as specific. I don't really remember because I don't really rate my BoxyCharm. So maybe I should look into that. Okay, so this is your regular Ipsy. Uh, I have a Farrah brush. This is a short shading brush. I like these brushes. They're really good for like the lower lash line or the outer corner. So I really like that. I really like getting brushes in my bags. So that, that's a good way to start off. So this is the bag for the month of August. And let's see, the first item we have is Daily Hemp Oil Facial Cleanser from Feel. I don't think I've ever heard of this brand before. I do like trying new facial cleansers, so that's really nice. Uh, we have the Pure 1.4 and one mascara with hemp. I have received Pure um, mascaras before, but I don't think I've received this particular one. I actually really do like trying out new mascaras, so that's nice. Um, and that's really pretty. This is Meet Matte Hue's Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick from The Balm. This is the shade. It is a little bit more of a pink shade, so I'll probably put it in a giveaway because um, I'm not really a fan of pink. <laughs> um, and then this is one of the items that I chose. This is from a Glow Recipe. This is the Avocado Melt Retinol Eye Sleeping Mask. I love Glow, glow Recipe. Um, I actually have their um, Avocado Mask, Face Mask and the um, Watermelon Glow um, Overnight Mask, and I, I love those both. So I'm actually excited to try that out. So that is it for the regular Ipsy. And then the Big Daddy, Ipsy Glam Plus. Okay, so <laughs> this is the bag right here. I really don't know what that has to do with August. Um, but okay. The first thing I see is definitely a brush because I've actually I think I've received this brush before. Yeah. No. Okay. I've received complex culture brushes before, but I don't think I've received this one. I think the other one I did have is like a powder brush. This is more like of like an angled brush. 
I really, really like their brushes. I, they're super soft. They are really nice um, quality. So I definitely will be keeping that. And I do like angled brushes. So that's really nice. Nah, <laughs> yay. Okay. So I got a pack of three Araceli sponges. I love sponges. I apply my foundation, my concealer with sponges. So very happy to have these. And I actually really enjoy the brand Araceli. So it is definitely a win for me. Definitely comparable to a beauty blender. Can't wait to see how they, uh, how they just perform. That's nice. I like that. Okay, what next? Uh, from Skin and Lab, this is the E Plus Moisturizer. More moisturizers. <laughs> uh, the next item, okay, I'm actually really happy with this because this is like my first love uh, when it comes to mascara. So this is the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. For the longest time, you can go back in some of my videos and I'm like, I love this mascara. This is the best thing ever and I still stick by that. I do have other mascaras that I love as well, but this is definitely a must have for me. And last but not least, nice, we have the Viseart Petite Pro Palette. Um, I actually like Viseart. I guess for some people it's a hit or miss, but I really like the quality. Oh, it's so cute. Look at that. It's definitely petite. <laughs> um, but the colors are really pretty. It would definitely be like travel friendly. So you have... Um, all the shades up top are the mattes, and then all the shades on the bottom are the shimmers. So definitely travel friendly. It has a little mirror in here that if I, let's say I forgot a mirror, I didn't have one near, I could definitely see myself um, using this. So it would not be an issue. And it's very lightweight, and I like that it is like foldable. So very travel friendly um, if we ever get out of this pandemic and travel. Uh, like we used to. So this is definitely a plus. This is a high-end product. Um, I can't remember how much these go for. And it doesn't say. I know they're, kind of, they're quite pricey. Let's see how much it is. Viseart. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Viseart Petite Pro. So this little palette is actually $30. That's a very, very expensive, but like I said, the quality is there. I love it. Um, so yeah, right away, this covers the bag price. So we got this, we got the mascara, we got the three blenders and the, you know, moisturizer. What else did I get? Oh yeah, that brush. So this is actually a really good glam bag. So I would say out of all four boxes, bags, Ipsy glam bag is definitely the winner, the winner for me. So <laughs> I'm so sorry if this video was a little bit rough. Um, like I said, this is kind of my first time back in my makeup room. And um, hi baby, Lexi wants to say hi. <laughs> Wanna say hi? Yeah. You know mommy's not feeling good. Yeah. You make me feel better though. Yeah. I love you. Um so I still have my Star Ranch palette. I'm not gonna give that away in this video just because of the fact that I don't feel like my normal self. Um definitely a very uh different vibe in this video if you know what i mean uh so i will probably hold that off hopefully the next video will be extremely positive and happy and upbeat and i'll be back to my normal self that is my goal and um <laughs> she, she, she knows you know i love her yeah all right, I guess I really don't know how to end this thing, but um, 
you know, I love you guys. I love doing this. This makes me so happy. And um, I don't know, it feels good to kind of just get on camera. I was a little nervous of how I was going to come back and, you know, explain where I've been, but it, you know, I know that this is, this is definitely where I want to be. This is what I want to do. And this is something that I enjoy. And I'm glad I kind of pushed myself because I was thinking about just taking a shower and going back to bed. But um, I forced myself to do this video and it feels good. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. I hope to see you guys soon. I'll see you guys in the next video.